Hello and welcome to Intro to Distance Learning for June 2013. This video is about the three major points to consider when creating an online course. There are many things to consider when you're building an online course, but these are probably the three most important to keep in mind no matter what kind of content you're creating or what kind of design you envision. The first thing to think about is creating bite-sized content. I know a lot of the content in your course may be very complex. It's important to think of ways that you can break that down into smaller chunks. People may be viewing this on the train, on the bus, with a lot of distractions going on. We're competing for attention, and anything that lasts too long, you're kind of setting yourself up for failure that students won't be paying as much attention as you would like. So keeping it bite-sized is very important. Another point to keep in mind is you want to be responsive. Students don't want to take a correspondence course. They want to feel like they're part of a class, they're part of a community. It's very hard to recreate that sense that you have when you're in a face-to-face -face class in an online environment, so you need to be as responsive as possible. And the last point to consider that you don't want to create dead-end content. So you don't want to create content that just sits there and when a student's finished, they don't know what else to do but just consume more content. You want them to apply that that knowledge they just got in some way. So that may mean asking a question, that may mean thinking of a way for them to demonstrate that they absorbed and understand what you just taught. So those are the three basic principles. Bite-sized content, be responsive, and avoid dead-end content. And we'll hammer this out a little further in the course.